hi everybody and welcome to the Gibraltar cable cars and we're about to head up to the top. As you can see, here's the map behind me. The cable car starts here and it's going to take us all the way to the top of the rock. Also on this map, you can see a couple different other tours that you can do along the way. For today, we're just going up to the top. We're gonna tour around this area, see the monkeys and maybe do a little hiking and either come down on the cable car or else take the trails back down this way and come down. Over here on this side, we've got the prices. So to go up and down, it's 17 pounds. That's for adults. Keep in mind that there are a lot of tour guides out in front of here and along the streets of Gibraltar that are selling tours for 40 pounds typically. And those are gonna give you access to four different more areas, the caves, the, the Pillar of Hercules, the castle, and so you get those options for the 40 pounds, but if you just want to take the cable car up to the top, that's what you can do here. So come along, let's go see what it's like. So I'm super excited about going up in this cable car and this is the little waiting area and all along here there's all this information about the monkeys that are up here not to feed them not to pet them that type of thing so when you come to this spot this is definitely a cool spot while you're waiting to read a little bit about uh, the monkeys and whatnot and this is gregory he's the alpha male <laughs> Oh. We're almost there. Perfect. Solid ground. Oh, look right here, I saw. Welcome to the top of the Rock of Gibraltar. Down below me, you're seeing the actual city of Gibraltar. Right behind that, you're seeing Spain, where I live in La Linea. So we took the cable car up here. There's a nice little area to explore up here. We're gonna go have a coffee in the cafe and then maybe head on head back down. But you have plenty of options when you're coming here to Gibraltar. You don't just have to jump in the tourist vans. You can actually just pay the cable car and come up here yourself and explore on your own time. Look, he got something up there. All right, so we made it to the top of the rock on the cable car. There's a cool cafe. We just had a little bit of lunch with some spectacular views. You can see all of Gibraltar, the main part of the city, the airport, and you can see down into Spain. One thing to be really careful about is the monkeys are very vicious. They will try to get you. They already jumped on me and tried to get my backpack. I saw them stealing someone else's backpack. If you're carrying a plastic bag or anything like that, the monkeys are gonna come right up to you and try to take it out of your hand. So be very careful and cautious around these little monkey devils. <laughs> Careful. Oh, it's on her. Oh. 
So trust me when I say that you need to be extremely careful around these monkeys. One jumped on top of me, broke my necklace, and as you can see in this video, the monkey jumped on top of the woman's head, and it was hard to capture it because she was around the ledge. However, it was like gripped onto her, and these things have sharp nails and sharp teeth, so you definitely need to use caution because these monkeys are everywhere and they come out of nowhere. Oh, did you see him jump on the yeah, kid? Yeah, I saw him jump on her. I did my camera like this, but I can only see her head. Back down at the bottom, we did the cable car up and back down, which was 17 pounds per person. Overall, I think this was the perfect amount of time. It's about a five minute ride up. We spent an hour up there walking around, looking at the sights, had a coffee, and then took the five minute ride back. For the 17 pounds, we thought that this was the perfect amount of time to spend going up to the top of the rock.